Adele. Hey. Wow. Huh? Did you get a load of that one? Yo, she's something else, man. Isn't she? Who could fuck her up? I know. Me and you couldn't take that bitch. She must have made up a story or something to get in there. I bet she you. heard about it from a friend in there. And my guess is, you know, she's living in some dump and decided to move over. Gotta find out what the fuck the story is. I'm gonna find out right now. <laughs> Shit. You! How's the laundry coming along? It's coming along. Huh? Coming along? Yeah. Remember ice skates? No. Maybe I'll take you ice skating sometime. That'd be fun. I guess. So, Dale, if you don't mind my saying, with all due respect, I was just wondering how you kind of, you know, wound up over there. Because, uh, looks like you could <laughs> take care of yourself. It's none of your business. Ah, okay. Because the thing about it is that I just don't see anybody taking you down. That is some shiner you got there. Can you tell yeah. me how it happened? I was home, and uh, I was talking to somebody, and uh, I said something I shouldn't have said. So this person struck you? No. I fell. Yeah, I fell. I'm clumsy. I'm really clumsy. I trip all the time. But, um, you know, I kind of, I deserved it, actually. I was, I was wrong. Yeah. Uh, excuse me, we're here. Need some money. You need money? I gave you $40 yesterday. What for? I'm fucking hungry, man. I'm waiting around all this fucking time for you and shit. Can't you see I'm in pain here? I know. I'm sorry. But I'm fucking hungry right now. What are you gonna get? Some fucking fruit chews. Fruit chews? You don't bear those off of your teeth? You wanna spend the winter in the dentist's office? Put this shit on my fucking tab. On your tab? Yeah. Well, yeah, like, yeah, like you're gonna pay me back. You know I got you. Give me a few dollars, man. Right. I'll give you some. Love you, Larry. Yeah, I love you too. I'm sorry, you know him? Yeah, he lives with me. You live together? Yeah, we live together. Uh huh. You know, I didn't even ask him to move in. He just moved in, doesn't pay any rent, and he eats all my food, knows all about me, knows my mother's maiden name. I gotta get this guy out of my house. It's driving me crazy. Hi, sir. We're responding to a domestic battery call. I, I, I don't live here. Um, the owner of the house, he, he, he just left. Sir, you matched the description of somebody who's been reported for domestic battery at this address. No, 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 no. See, the, the owner, he just walked out. Okay. He'll be right back. Well, apparently you've been living here with Mr. David, and he's been trying to get rid of you. It's all in the doctor's statement. No, 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 yeah. no, look, yeah. we can just talk to Mr. David. Sure, explain you everything. You won't be speaking to Mr. David. He's being moved to a safe house. What? No, no, I was just returning a computer. You're going to jail now. I'm a computer, I don't live here. You're making a mistake. Wait for the guy to come back. He'll tell you. God damn it.